to you again this morning. Uh, just to recap on the session that we did, quite a few, a couple of quite simple changes, but they can have a profound effect on the way in which you swing the golf club. First of all, we discussed that the shoulder alignment was getting a little bit open in relation to where the feet and the club were pointing at address. That's going to produce an out-to-in swing path. Uh, a little bit more ex exaggerated than you would like. So the feeling there to get the shoulders squarer is that you just drop that right shoulder back and feel higher in your left side. The next issue we discussed was giving yourself a little bit more room here between club and ball. You can see here with Tiger on the right that there's room there to pass the right hand between him and the golf club without adjusting anything. Uh, you actually achieve it on this one but you weren't there at the start of your lesson. So again that's a way of policing it. In regards to your swing itself, what we've got to try and do is alter the shape of your golf swing. What we see with yourself is we see a club that goes back in the general direction of the red ball, if you will, as shown on this footage. So the club's going to go back over the red and then it's going to return over the red. So we're going to go back over the red and we're going to return over the red, producing a swing that works too much to the left. If we swing to the left, we're going to keep the blade open and we're going to hit the ball left to right with your, loft, with your straight face clubs and pull it down the left side with your more lofty clubs. What we see in contrast with someone like Tiger is we see a takeaway that takes the club back in the general direction of the red ball and then returns the club to impact in the general direction of the blue ball. So with Tiger, we're going back over the red, down over the blue, which imparts the golf ball more to the right of target, allowing Tiger, as you can see there, to release the golf club and rotate the forearms on the way through. If you can implement this small change into your swing, you're going to see, as you did at the end of the lesson, much more well-struck online golf shots that move a little bit right to left. It's a great visual and a great way of practicing. Good luck and keep in touch. See you soon.